Our lab is very interested in mother-to-child transmission of HIV, and one of the things we've been doing for the last several years is modeling that transmission in the macaque and in mother and baby macaques. And we recently published a study that showed that treatment with very low levels of antibodies could actually help control infection. And this study that I'll be talking about is a follow-up follow study to that one in which we looked at the same level of antibodies in the rhesus macaque. And this time we got very exciting results in that four out of six of our treated animals resisted infection completely and the other two controlled to much, much better levels than we had seen in the pigtailed macaques. I think it's really good news for transmission of HIV if it can get to the clinic. And there are plans, as I understand it, through NIH to use some of the newly discovered human monoclonals in the clinical setting to try to block infection. Our study is helpful, I think, in informing what kinds of levels of these monoclonals are necessary to achieve full protection or better, better control of viremia.